I'm Hannah. I'm here with Robert uh, Bob Hardy, who is going to be one of our candidates for Centerville Town Council. Bob, welcome. Uh, maybe you can start out by telling us a little bit about yourself. Hi, I'm Bob Hardy. I would like to thank Queen Anne's County TV and the Record Observer for this opportunity to reach the voters of the town of Centerville. I've been a resident of Centerville for 12 years, the county for 30 plus, and I have lived in Maryland over 50 years. I've been active in my community, the county, and the town. I am married to Debbie Hardy. She's a retired elementary and high school teacher who currently works at Queen Anne's County Library. I have four children, six grandchildren, and two of my sons graduated from Queen Anne's County High School. I am a retired major in the United States Army Reserve. I have three college degrees. I have a bachelor's in metallurgical engineering, two master's degrees, one in material science, and I think most important is my engineering administration master's, both from George Washington University. I had a 35-year career in engineering as a civil servant for Navy R&D. We provided day-to-day -day solutions for all Navy ships and submarines. I am proud to have been a federal employee to keep our Navy number one and our country safe. I planned, organized, and conducted numerous multi-million dollar programs and projects interacting with academia and industry. I successfully led and managed the design and construction of a $30 million, 150,000 square foot materials R&D lab. I was involved in many teaming. I was involved in teaming and leading numerous Navy business and strategic planning activities. I recruited over 30 university and was awarded honorary alumni by University of Maryland at College Park and received the Certificate of Excellence from UMBC. I created and was awarded a trademark, P4I. You'll hear more about that. And Bo, after my retirement, I worked to promote, encourage, and inspire young people in STEM education. I worked with the Board of Ed, in fact, here in Queen Anne's County. Thank you. Bob, why don't you take a minute and tell us why you decided to run for town council? It is the right time for me to serve my community. My vision for the town of Centerville is first and foremost, maintain the family-oriented nature and our excellent lifestyle of our community. I want to support and encourage our business community to flourish and be a driver for moving Centerville into the future. Make Centerville a destination with our historic past, restaurants, and cultural assets. My involvement in the community has been vast. I've been doing it for 30 plus years. I served on a town of Centerville Parks Advisory Board. I was an executive board member of Character Counts Program. Last couple of years, I was a substitute teacher at the high school and the middle school here in Centerville. I served on my community's covenants and lifestyles committee. I was chairperson for three years at the annual Artisans Festival. So thank you. That's why I'm running. I want to serve my community. Great. Thanks, Bob. Um, what are some of the major issues you see the town of Centerville facing? I don't call them issues. They are my three main interests. Improved communications, economic development, and tourism. When I say improved communications, I believe it's with our citizens between the town government talking about the operations. We can do this through website, social media presence, you know, reaching out, uh, increase outreach to work with businesses, local Queen Anne's County government, and the cultural organizations like the clubs, the historical societies, our schools, our churches, our community groups. Economic development. Again, I want to maintain the family-oriented values and a small town feel. We work together to invigorate the town of Centerville. The pro planning, foresight, and teamwork, we create new business opportunities, increase our tax base, and provide job opportunities. All right, Bob, out of those things, what's, what's one of the main things you hope to accomplish? The main things is with tourism, I think we can kind of make Centerville the county seat, a destination, not just a pass-through. Many other county seats on the Eastern Shore, they have that unique nature and assets that we also have. 
And through that, we will create business opportunities, jobs for our people and our young people. So working together, we can make Centerville a shining star of the Eastern Shore. It is, we are located at the headwaters of the Corsica River. We have a restaurant, a brewery, art galleries, the wharf. And our biggest asset is our historical, architecturally beautiful 18th century homes and buildings. I want to make Centerville a destination. Are there any other things you'd like the voters to know? Yes. Um, I will listen, learn, and serve all the citizens of Centerville. I believe in working together. We will learn from the past, live in the present, and plan for the future. I hope to have open communications and definitely fiscal accountability and responsibility. Uh, again, I would like to thank Queen Anne's County TV and the Record Observer for the, this opportunity to reach all the voters in Queen Anne's. If you haven't realized this, I am a successful, professional, and innovative individual with 35 years of experience in various positions and roles in government. Again, I will achieve my goals through positive and forward thinking, through listening, learning, serving all citizens of Centerville. And P4I is professional, personable, proactive, persistent with integrity. So I'm asking for you to vote for Bob Hardy for Centerville Town Council. My email address, if you want to give me your thoughts, comments, ideas, is friendsofbobhardy at gmail. And my Facebook page is Friends of Bob Hardy. Thank you for listening. Looking forward to getting your vote. Hopefully, you will hear more from me in the future. All right. Thanks for joining us today. You're most welcome.